Christina Jacobs uh, just got done with a victory against Northwestern that competed, completed a very successful weekend for you ladies. Uh, I really can't ask for much more with a win against Notre Dame and the win today against Northwestern. What would you highlight individually for your weekend? Today I'd say the uh, individual 100 breaststroke. Um, I kind of had to regroup after a uh, not so hot swim in the relay, so John told me to put the rage into it, and um, I felt a lot stronger than I did in the relay, so I was glad to bring it back. And you were honored as the uh, Boilermaker Award recipient today. Uh, I believe Carly Mercer selected you for that. Yeah. And you have, uh, as a senior, I'm sure that's not the first time you've won that award, but right. you'll get to uh, award it next time. Yeah. How, what goes into that thinking? Who gets it? Um, it definitely uh, goes to whoever encompasses our 12 core values and who has really stood out to me that week. Um, we'll, we'll give it to the next person at Iowa, so I'm really going to be looking for someone in these next two weeks and at that meet. So. As a senior, kind of have you thought about cherishing these last uh, home meets this year? I know there aren't as many as maybe as in years past, but right. certainly this weekend seems very fun. Yeah, this weekend these two meets have always been pretty brutal and the feeling that you have when you're finished is kind of indescribable. So I feel really overjoyed right now and I'm kind of trying to enjoy my last moments here in the BAC. Thanks for the time. Yeah. Good luck going forward. Thanks. John Klinge just got done with a nice victory against Northwestern that caps off a pretty successful weekend. Really can't ask for much more than a win against an in-state rival Notre Dame and then a Big Ten team in Northwestern. What would you highlight about today? Um, I, you know, I, I think today it was a good test for us because, um, you know, we need to learn how to come back the second day and, and swim hard um, and duplicate the times and the races from the day before. Um, we still have some work to do, um, but it's always fun to swim two good opponents within 24 hours. I know we talked a little bit about her last night, but Lauren Roth, just a very impressive weekend. Three more individual victories today. She seems to really have responded, uh, you know, maybe after you know, coming back as a senior this year. Um, you know, I, I think if you ask her, she doesn't want to be reminded she's a senior. She, <laughs> she wants to uh, just get, get through this year, and it, it upsets her a little bit to know that this is her last season, so I shouldn't even have said that. But um, she, uh, we've relied on her since her freshman year. She does a good job in every race we put her in, especially the tough doubles that we have her do. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, she's, she's one to rely on every weekend. And your newcomers continue to excel as well. I think you got victories today from uh, Amy Katz, Rhiannon Sheets, and Megan Gallagher. Yeah, I mean, I, I think our, our freshmen have really um, done a good job, and, and we expect a lot of them as your, uh, out of them as your on. Thanks for the time. Thank you.